Aaron, uncovering this weekend new information about an alleged visa fraud scheme involving staged robberies. One at Northwest Houston gas station in January ended with the alleged fake robber being shot dead by a bystander. ABC 13's Luke Jones caught up with a purported victim of another robbery police believe was staged. He's live in Northwest Houston with the interview you'll see only on 13. Luke. Tom, this is all pretty interesting. So back in February of 2023, Akbar Jawani says he, his brother, and his cousin are all here at this gas station pumping gas when a man runs up and robs them. Now, police believe the robber was most likely Rashad Scott. The same man shot and killed in another robbery at another gas station earlier this year. Basically, there have been a bunch of these robberies around town. Police say the victims are paying to be robbed so they can then file police reports and use their status as crime victims to apply for U visas and stay in the country. Jawani, who says he's originally from India, insists that's not what happened here. A guy, he came on the gas station and he just pulled me out inside, go inside in the car and he robbed me. Mm. Did you apply for a U visa after this? After three or four months. You waited three or four months? Because police are trying to say that basically you and some other people are paying to be robbed so you can then apply for U visas. And you're flat out denying that's the case at all. All right, so you heard there a vehement denial from one of the purported fake robbery victims. We did check, by the way, no charges have been filed against Giovanni, and he says he hasn't heard from police or from immigration officials. But now we're live in Northwest Houston. Luke Jones, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.